Good morning people, another day in Vienna and we're not going to be here for that much longer because we are going to get a bus out of here over to Slovakia, to Bratislava. Believe it or not, that bus cost us £4 each and there's three of us, so incredible. What, 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 I just can't even believe how cheap that is. So, uh, I'm gonna head over there shortly, but we've been hearing police cars going past all night and all day in our apartment. And uh, I've got to say, Austria, your police cars have the funniest sound I've ever heard in my life. It's like, it's, the, it's just the strangest sound. What do our cuss sirens sound like? Nino, Nino. Ours is just. Ours is are quite a bit different to, to Austria's, and, and yeah, we find it when we hear them. Obviously, you know, we're like, what, what is that? <laughs> we finally saw what they were last night, but yeah, very interesting sound in there. <laughs> Police loves Austria, but um, but yeah, we're gonna head over to the uh, the bus station shortly and see what a Flixbus ride from Austria to Slovakia is like. So join us, let's do this. Right guys, just on our way to the bus station, but it's important to know if you're coming to Vienna that <coughs> pretty much everything is closed on a Sunday. I mean, this is the current, this is our current view. We're in kind of one of the main high streets and this is, this is our view currently. Now, thankfully for us, there is a restaurant open not far from the bus station. So we're gonna go and get some, uh, strangely there's some Chivapcici. So if you've uh, seen our Bosnian journey, where we went to Mostar, we loved Chivapcici. And we had it in Split as well in Croatia. And uh, we're gonna have a bit here. It's not traditional Austrian fare, but really we don't have many options currently. So we're heading now down to the, uh, the metro station. And we are gonna go and try some food and then get on this bus. Okay, so we've made it. We are here at the bus station, as you can see behind me. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it's quite empty at the moment. We've got another hour until our bus arrives, but went to a lovely restaurant just over there uh, called um, the Restaurant Savievo. So it's a Bosnian style restaurant and uh, it was very nice. So if you're ever in the area, I'd recommend. But uh, yeah, let's go and wait for our bus and see uh, what this journey is like. Right, we're on the bus, ready to go. You guys excited? Alright. <laughs> Never been to Bratislava before, so it's gonna be a new city for us. Not been to Slovakia either actually, so really excited. And uh yeah, it's a beautiful day. So hopefully it carries through. The weather always follows us around the uh, countries, doesn't it? The weather. Yeah, negative yeah. the bad English weather always follows us around. people we've made it to Slovakia and what a beautiful looking city Bratislava is so far and we've just arrived and I want to give you my thoughts about the Flixbus journey so for me it was fantastic it was really really straightforward the driver was friendly really well priced the bus was comfortable we didn't have any border check either which was very surprising because we was prepared for one and it was just a generally good experience what did, what did you guys think very quick very straightforward, very quick. Yeah. Like yeah. We went through the board, but we didn't get Yeah, there was no like hassle. And if you've seen our video from Bosnia, you will see that we had a massive situation with border control over there. So it was a complete different experience. So a few people have said in previous videos that I've been a little bit critical of um, Flixbus before. 
it's not that I was critical of Flixbus as a company, but I was critical of that particular journey in the UK because it wasn't very pleasant. But in terms of the journeys I've taken from Flixbus, I've not had any problems. So anything you hear that's negative about Flixbus, please do consider that. It is hearsay, generally speaking, and actually most of the experience I've had on Flixbuses in Europe have been pleasant. And I'll be sure to do a few more in England as well, so I can get a fair experience there as well. But uh, yeah, there we go. We're in Slovakia, so please follow us for our next video where we're going to be exploring the city of Bratislava. We don't have very long and it's a lovely, beautiful, sunny day, so we've got lots for to explore in a short, yeah, for a change. Usually raining where we go, but it's uh, a beautiful, lovely day and we're going to explore the city. So do join us on our next video where we have a look around the city and we really appreciate you watching this video. Take care, people. Catch you soon.